why are mortgage rates going up if the Federal Reserve Bank just cut the discount rate? I'm Brian Brady from Worldwide Credit Corporation, and I'm about to tell you in the next 90 seconds. You see, markets are a discounting mechanism, and while they certainly react to news from the Federal Reserve Bank, they anticipate certain news. In this case, the Federal Reserve Bank cut interest rates today, but said this is probably it. They don't intend to cut them in the future. Now, President Trump got all bent out of shape about this, but the thing is the bond market's expected not only for the Federal Reserve to cut today, but to continue cutting in the future. And what they did was they thought, because of those future cuts, they started bidding the bond market up, which brought mortgage rates down. And when the Fed disappointed them today, we started seeing mortgage rates go up. Let me try to give you an example, a little chalk talk here on the board. Imagine this is a skating rink. The great Wayne Gretzky once said he was so great because he tried to skate where the puck would be, not where the puck was at the time. And in this case, the bond market tried to do that and they got caught flat footed. So if green is the bond market and orange is mortgage rates and purple is the Federal Reserve Bank, the Federal Reserve Bank is bringing the puck up the ice and everybody anticipated the Federal Reserve Bank to pass it across the blue line over to here. So what happened was the bond market started skating without crossing the blue line towards the puck. Mortgage rates actually went across the blue line. It could have been off sides. But what happened? The Federal Reserve Bank skated to center ice and held on to the puck and got ready to shoot it itself. It didn't move the puck towards the corner. So what happened was the bond market got scared and they moved back to get behind the Federal Reserve Bank and mortgage rates who had already gone across the blue line realized that they might be offsides, so they scooted back behind the bond market. It's kind of weird. It's kind of a strange analogy, but sometimes you have to understand that rate cuts actually can lead to higher rates if the bond market overly anticipated future rate cuts in the future. Look, call me if you're thinking about refinancing or if you're getting ready to purchase a house. I'm one of the few guys that actually watches the bond market in the mortgage business. My number is 858-777-9751.